Oh, up uh, video. Like I said, the next video that's coming is either the GS300 or the Yakuza is going to be in the next YouTube video that I upload. So be ready for that. Make sure you guys share this video with all your console friends and anyone else that needs a tune for the 400 b Because as you guys can see, this thing is shredding already. And I just joined Bob. Holy shit. But I'm going to let you show you guys some lines. This thing's pretty clean, pretty smooth. Look at those transitions line around that corner now the only thing i had to do with the transition the gears were a little too short and the caster uh for the suspension was a little too high so i adjusted that so i had to adjust the ackerman the caster and the transmission to get it to hold lines like this did before it wasn't holding lines this good it was like all right it's kind of going inside going too wide kind of felt like you had to fight the car to get wide and then when it got wide you had to fight the car to like stay on the track so now it feels like the car gets wide and it's easy to like go in and get back on the track yeah very smooth car uh, i say this is one of my favorite cars in the game right now i'm not gonna lie 400z is probably one of the best cars to come to this new update on top of the gs300 and the yakuza i say if i had to rate the cars top three 400z GS300, and then the Yakuza would be in third place. Some people may argue that the K truck is going to be top three somewhere. Hey, if you feel that way, let me know what you think your top three cars are down below in the comment section. I'm curious. I want to see what you guys think also, man. But that means that's going to wrap up the video for today. This has been your boy, Taz Kids, playing Cars for Fish Online. And today, I showed you guys on the 400Z Ultimate Dress Setup. I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace.